The heydays of Tombstone and its legacy started right down here, as deep as 600 feet underground in over 250 miles of tunnels. It was Ed Shefflin and us miners who came down here and started the little silver camp out on what was then known as Goose Flats, later to become the boom town of Tombstone, a town that's still famous to this very day. Thousands of us flooded into town, just hoping to strike it rich down in these shafts. And this, this is what it was all about. Men got murdered for the silver out in them hills and consumption, fights, addictions. Well, that's what killed most of us at a young age. The devil had a say in this town that took a man for breakfast every day. And that made Boot Hill a very busy place. And the undertakers, they earned well on our pain and sorrow. Not only were miners flocking into town, but hundreds of soil doves, similar to me. The women might have been outnumbered, but the men, they knew our worth. With desire came love, and with love came jealousy. I found my soulmate. But do you think that I would live happily ever after? When one is desired, it doesn't take long for the enemies to pack up like hungry wolves. The women of Easy Morals came from all over Europe, and so did I. As a shady lady and a madame, I was known as Little Gertie. I earned a fortune in this town. However, I was not willing to share my lovers or my territory with any of the other painted cats. Reaching jealousy was enough to kill in Tombstone. If I couldn't have him, nobody else would. Like Lorraine Bernard, Little Gertie is a true historic figure of the town tombstone. It's said that Tombstone had over 120 saloons and poured whiskey 24 seven. Gambling, fights and killings took place on a daily basis. The red light district spanned over six blocks, and sin ruled just as much as silver, if not more. According to historic city papers, over a thousand prostitutes offered their trade in tombstone. Disease and a high suicidal rate dominated devil's addiction on Tufnut Street. Tombstone in 8081 was so much more than one famous gunfight. Our story is based on four lead characters. And their hope for a better tomorrow and their desire lead to greed and addiction. It triggers off terrible events that end deadly. We want to paint a picture of how dangerous it was living in pioneer towns and how it changed society, most times not for the better. Our production is meant to be a window into the glorious past of a town that stands like no other for the Wild West. We're proud to have amazing talents, award-winning recording artists, and Emmy-nominated filmmaker Christian B. Mesa on board. Join us on our adventure back into Tombstone's heydays 
support us to make this unique project happen. Thank you.